I want to share a nugget from my life to, to describe why I believe so much in your project. And it's actually uh, a nugget that, a true life story nugget that changed my life. You see the screen now? Mm -hmm. uh, my mother, she died like when I was about 20, you know, and for me that was like devastating. I was like, uh, yeah, that's, I started to have depressions and I, but I still continued fighting, you know, like I took, um, I start, like I, I got myself to university, I started a company and all of this, right? So, and I was having a really hard time around the, I think this was a period like 15 years ago before she passed away. So I went to her house, you know, and you know, my grandmother, she had these eyes, you know, that if you watched them, you, you felt good, you know, like it, it, it warmed your soul, you know, and it doesn't matter how many people came to her house, you know, she had food for everybody. It doesn't matter how many people came to sleep, there was bed for everybody. <laughs> she was like the center of the universe for us, you know, like Abuelita Deli. And one day she noticed, you know, I was, I was really, really bad shape, you know, like my business was not going as I wanted, like my life was not in the place I wanted to be. So she asked me, she said, like, my son, like, how, how are you feeling? Like, what's wrong? So I told her, like, I don't want to, I don't want to create stress for you, but I'm not in a good position and I'm not feeling good, you know. So she just looked at me and she gave me this nugget. She says, my son, I'm soon dead. And how I wish I could be you at this moment that has all the future ahead. Despite your current unpleasant period, you're still breathing. So bottle it out, my son. I believe in you. And that changed everything for me. It changed my perspective of life. It changed everything, you know, because I realized that I was not only being ungrateful to, to, to life itself, you know, that as long as we're breathing, we can fight, you know, and we take that for given, you know, and she was not. She was counting every breath she could see us, you know, because she knew that I will be dead tomorrow. I will be dead, you know. And she died not long after, man. That's it's a hard story to tell, man. But that's the reason that I, when I met you, I, I really believe that empowering others in the way you do can change lives, man. Wonderful. Mm -hmm.